All right, let's get you outside. We got a nice shot of uh, some snow up in Williams. Sarah posted this to our first alert weather page. It's a little dark, kind of Blair Witch style, uh, but she was up early and uh, nice shot there. Thank you, Sarah. We got like 70,000 members on that weather page. So if you want to see weather before it even hits the air, that's the place to do it. Just look up First Alert Weather AZ Family on Facebook and you'll find it. Uh, two to a few inches. Most of the snow has already fallen in the mountains. In fact, we have a clear picture in Flagstaff. Some snow on the ground. It's been pretty light. This storm system continued to sag to the south and most of the moisture is staying in southern Arizona. The temperatures are there. If we were to throw a bunch of moisture into Flagstaff right now, it'd be snowing like crazy because it's 23 degrees, but most of the action is to the south. In fact, it's over the valley and it's impacting the West Valley. Some moderate rainfall over the I-10, Buckeye, Conger, places like that, Perryville, seeing the rain this morning. That's why we have a first alert this morning because we think it's going to be a soggy commute. In fact, 7, 8, 9 a.m., we might even see some pockets of heavy rain. Maricopa, you guys are getting a drink right now. Same with Gila Bend. Some light rain pushing into Sun Lakes, Chandler, and the Southeast Valley. Eventually, uh, this pocket, this area of rain is going to push to the east and then start to move north into the valley. So we're clear right now in the Southeast Valley, but that will change as we get going in the next few hours. Temperatures aren't too bad. They're in the 40s. I'd still bring a jacket because we'll be around 58 degrees later on this afternoon. And that's kind of chilly for us in the valley. 23 in Flagstaff, 9 up in Window Rock in the Navajo Nation, 29 in Payson. I think some snow might get mixed into the rain this morning in Payson. Same story with Prescott because we are in the 30s and the 20s, but we're not looking for serious accumulation. Our uh, system is right here. You see this little counterclockwise spin right over the Baja. That's our little rainmaker and it's going to deliver this morning. So here's 6 a.m. These orange pieces and pockets, that's more uh, heavy rain. So there might be some areas this morning that it's a little tough to drive in, especially up on the 101 by Scottsdale. This is 8 a.m. Cave Creek, Deer Valley, Anthem. I think you guys are going to get in on this action. I don't think there's a flood risk, but you might need to put the window wipers on like the medium setting or the high setting opposed to that delay where you're wondering, are these even on? <laughs> it's like 10 minutes has gone by and you haven't seen anything. <laughs> uh, let's get you to the lunchtime. We're starting to break things up a little bit. And then by the evening, we really thin things out. So that's why I said a first alert morning because the bulk of this stuff is during the morning commute and not so much the evening commute. We'll have sporadic rain chances overnight, but Wednesday looks like a better uh, situation. Most of us will see a quarter inch or less as far as the rain goes. An um, inch or so maybe possible in the mountains. We're really not concerned about the snow threat up north. Maybe a couple slick areas here and there. 31 for the high in Flagstaff, 44 in Prescott, 43 in Payson, and 53 in Globe for your high today. First alert, 7-day forecast, 58 today with that chance of rain, mainly in the morning. 65 tomorrow and dry, 66 on Thursday. Friday is great, 71 and dry. Saturday, 71. Sunday, 72 degrees with sunny and dry conditions.